Welcome to the Star Wars Galaxy. Here you can see planets from Coruscant down to Kamino, each siding with one of the main factions at war, the Republic and the Separatists. Two commanders lead their respective sides. Commander Rooster controls the Republic, while the evil Dave is in charge of the Separatists. Each commander has his strengths and weaknesses, with Rooster, our main protagonist, focusing on canon-accurate fleet compositions. These include four different tiers that will be loosely followed and potentially adjusted throughout the campaign. Meanwhile, Dave, the enemy, will throw every everything he has at Rooster, including hundreds of ships at a time. In this episode, Rooster will assemble his new siege fleet to combat Commander Dave's relentless assault. Will he succeed? Let's find out. Alright, and welcome back to Star Wars Empire at War, but make it realistic. Yes, we are playing the wonderful mod, Republic at War, again, and we're gonna get right into it, per usual. In the last episode, we had taken back Corellia, which we had actually lost, uh, Torn Company. Thank goodness they came back and Anakin was there to avenge them. So I'm thinking for this time, for this plan, since they had sent their fleet from likely Christophsis, I think Anakin needs to go and make a strike on them. So I think that's kind of our plan. We've got our fantastic realistic fleet right here. We're going to get right into it. Actually, but before that, let me make sure I've got all our defenses kind of down pat. You see, for instance, look at Bespin. Bespin beautifully well defended literally nothing can uh, can do anything to stop Training them Naboo truth. could use a few Training extra soldiers. troops maybe Malastare, you know they're doing great you see in this part of the campaign most of our fights that are going to be coming from uh well most of our fights that we can really dwindle down the numbers of the separatists will be on the back line when we're defending like look at our history oh wow We've been doing fantastic militarily, oh my gosh. But even economically, oh my gosh. I mean, I, I'm just incredible organizer. <laughs> this campaign's actually doing pretty well. And we have been pretty much destroying the Separatists as of late. Uh, just because of, well, because we've kind of been winning a lot of battles. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to try to bait them into making some bold moves. For instance, Kashyyyk. Kashyyyk has a space station. It's pretty minimal. I actually want to fight on the ground, so I might auto-resolve. Other places, such as, um, where is it? Mon Cala. Mon Cala, I want to fight uh, in space, because we've got the Mon Cala cruisers. I think that'd be extremely entertaining, and a level 5 space station, plus a, um, a space-to-ground, or a ground-to-space weapon, hypervelocity cannon. That sounds absolutely glorious and super rad. Look at Coda's militia there, who I think I killed last time. We, uh, we've got things kind of rolling. Now, eventually, I think what I want to do is I want them to attack Coruscant. You know, maybe I should allow them, you know, maybe I should allow them to take Corellia from us so they have a complete unobstructed Can't access to Coruscant me. just so we can have a super rad battle uh, with a ton of vendors because that would be a realistic fleet. So you know what? Okay. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll bait them. I'm going to get a, a few more 501st clones Can't and then with me. that we'll just keep pushing. We'll move some of the fleets down here because it's going to cut off our line. So... I guess that's kind of our little our little strategy here. Bait them into attacking Coruscant, which I don't think their AI is going to be extremely keen on doing. But if I make a big enough fleet on Coruscant and then a, a large enough fleet on Duro, one that's, I think, larger on Duro would probably be better because the AI will have to calculate, well, Coruscant has this amount of ships on its, on its plan or on its orbit and then Duro has that amount of ships. Let's go for Coruscant because it's a little bit less defended. So I think that's what we'll do. I'll kind of send uh, the experimental ships like the Victory over to Duro as well. That might augment their uh, their fleet. Plus I'll, I'll hand them over the glorious Imperial Star Destroyer fleet. Speaking of glorious, where is complete. the Pride of the Core? It, it should be, oh, by Mandalore, right? We took over Mandalore as well. That's amazing. Let's see if we can, oh, if we can get some troops in there. We'll you anywhere, sir. Oh, finally, we've kind of, <laughs> finally, we've taken, we've gotten to Yavin. That's what I like to hear. We have finally gotten to Yavin. Got an ISD with Sheev Palpy over there. <clears throat> Let me, uh, yeah. 
let, keep the scrap merchants busy. let me move Palps over. <laughs> you you probably need to be on Coruscant, homie. Yeah. I'm going to send you over there and kind of do your thing. All right, so we're scratching that. We're opening up Corellia. We're going to allow them to kind of do their thing. Okay? So since we're taking over Corellia, let's see where our, our next heading is. Ready for command, sir. Well, that was kind of creepy. Uh, ooh. If we can kind of break through this bottom left right here getting a little bit of lag notably right here if we can break through this bottom left line then it will cut off the separatists from Tactical a lot of our worlds oh, again but if we take out that back line that bottom left i won't have to worry about bestman anymore which would be great and then we can take out the bottom right with camino and then opening up po future possibilities with our clones it's a good idea it's a good idea we're proud to serve you general yeah uh, i'll consider <laughs> these droids are done for Oh boy. General. Let's see, let's see. Bring in our gunships. We've secured a build pad. Wherever they may be. Ah, oh, here they are. Okay, shinies. We've got some work to do until our evac arrives. I should really just put the gunships like right over here, right up front, just so I have full access to them so we don't have to keep doing this kind of back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> these droids, because they are relentless. You can't negotiate with droids. Now these these pod walkers, or these these ATP teams, they look like security walkers. What do they do? Premier oh, install lightly armored and armed armor with twin blaster cannons and grenade launch. However, the walker's superior agility make up for its light armor. You don't go. look that agile. Oh, you are that agile. Oh no, it's because you're. Copy that. Roger that sir. Look, look at that agile. Look at this. This is ridiculous. We've lost a and they didn't even lose anything. They're just here to waste my time. Command, sir. Just ridiculous. But this... This is different. <laughs> Homing spider droids. We haven't seen those in a while. We got some destroyer droids and heavy artillery. Now this... This looks fun. Alright. I haven't fought any... OOM spider droids since the beginning or at, at all I think now that I kind of thought about it for a second <laughs> so I'm going to kind of bottleneck them right here our biggest issue is going to be the artillery pieces which will try to Never surrender. One shot, you guys. One kill. Which will Copy try that. to take out our infantry. So I need speeders. Barks, I'm going to keep you as one. General, I'm going to keep you, well, you as oh, two. Gonna be a firefight. Watch the rear, General. And then I'm going to have the ATRTs as three. So what we're going to do yes, is we're going to have all the fast moving tanks. Because I think all of our tanks are pretty fast, besides the. Uh, the what is it? The oh, gonna be a firefight. So because of that, I'm gonna use that to our advantage. Or not. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Move the speedy boys. Move the fast ones. Come on now. Weapons check. Look proud to serve you, General. Stay frosty. Everyone get up. Oh god. Oh, that was brilliant. Okay, we gotta move. Try to see if we can yes, take out that artillery. Oh my gosh, this is a beautiful assault. Away Starting off with artillery. Oh no. <laughs> is this a bad idea? 100%. But if we can't take out that artillery, it will take us out. So I'm going to sacrifice our units here to kind of kill it. Any other artillery here? Anything else? Oh, it's this one. It's this one. Come on, boys. Just sacrifice yourselves for that. There you go. All right. All right. <laughs> now that. That was. Oh. <laughs> that was amazing. Literally one of the worst battles we've ever had. <laughs> Fleet. And they retreated. Oh, they're going after Mandalore. That is not a... That doesn't seem like a good idea. <laughs> I'm 
unless it's the malevolence, then that would be that'd be kind of shocking. Now, while we're at it, let me let me at least do something here. Uh, we need to take out Mechus, but we also I also want to actually get in a fight. Uh huh. Plocoon, your fleet is gone. Let's blow something up. Unit. All right. I'll get you uh, get you an order for some new ships ASAP. Meanwhile, Mandalore. Ready for command, sir. Dear, ooh. Is that enough? Is that enough to take on the Pride of the Core? I don't think so. I don't think that's enough. They actually no need something like the Malevolence. You know, this... <laughs> Look at this thing. <laughs> I mean... Bearing, sir. Upgrade in progress. <laughs> That's how oh my we'll goodness, I don't think that's enough. At a time. Matter, and on top of that, I have a, Your orders, General. a commander, an admiral. Standing by. Copy that. Is that a captain, actually? Fleet commander, see? We'll get there, sir. Corvette acknowledges. Our biggest problem will be the fighter battle. Upgrade complete. Begin Corvette standing by. Which we are actually kind of lacking right. in, frankly. Laser cannons online. We are going to need some more Corvettes. Bearing, all right, troops, here's the plan. I need all bombers. All bombers are going to have to start their assault on the hangar bay. Meanwhile, I want all fighters to go hunt the enemy. Constructing. Sir, do I have I've, got, I've got one set of normal bombers. Fantastic, beautiful. Look at these Y-wings. Look at this fight. This is... This was ballsy. Take it down. Yeah, so, like I said, our biggest problem will be the fighters. Look, the Pride of the Corps is already taking damage. Oh, sugar. <laughs> well, that sounds kind of chaotic. Okay. Let's see what I can do here. We've got... we got our Venator. Let's pull him up. Bring him up here. Yeah, your shields are, are getting knocked quick. We need more supportive ships. I want everyone's guns to get in range. I'm actually surprised. What is this? Defenses? Ooh, that's shipyard. What about shields? Armor? Armor? Damage taken by Corvettes, that doesn't really help. <laughs> That's not great. Wow, I'm surprised. Two Luger Hawks have done a significant amount of damage to this ship. Alright, well, since you've got full shields, go, go press the attack. My god, what a fleet, though. Look at that. With the Venator up top. Beautiful. Beautiful looking fleet. Oh no, the pride of the core. Oh! Oh, it's ramming the Lucre Hawks. Now oh, that is a shot, my gosh. Just running through them all. <laughs> Look at that, that. Now that's rad. Yeah, we're totally gonna win this. <laughs> yeah, without a shadow of a doubt, we're gonna win this one. Sending our decapitated bombers forward. We'll do our thingy thing. Alright, Y Wings. Seems like this was our. Ooh, ooh shot. Alright, they need fighter support though. We're gonna need some V Wings. It looks like our. Our Arc 170s are getting followed. By some bombers. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Come on, troops. Oh, nice. Look at that. The double bubble fleet. We had two victories, another Venator. Maybe I didn't even need the upgrade, if I'm being honest. You know, maybe I didn't actually need it, but hey, you know what? I'll take it. I'm surprised these guys are actually finding the enemy over here. You know, something I've kind of found weird about the hunt for enemies ability is no matter what happens, I wish we would go after the, the fighters that we already kind of spotted. Because right now, they're just kind of exposing the map. Which is cool, but... You know, I could use you in the battle. I could use you in the fight, you know? 
It'd be much better if you can actually be a part of the battle here instead of just kind of roaming about. You know? Oh my gosh, look at all those missiles. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. That was brutal. <laughs> We got 25 V wings, four V 19s. I think that was a poor decision by the Separatists, and that that is that's gonna cost them. <laughs> so now we're just gonna have to mop up the rest of them. <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> I feel bad, you know. Yeah, I say I kind of pity them. <laughs> Jeez Louise, they really wanted Mandalore back. They're like, no, 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 we need it. <laughs> We're just like, ah, yeah, it's, uh, it's too bad. <laughs> All right, let's take out Mechus. I think my original plan was to use the original, like, Mygito esque uh, front line, which is with the UTATs. And was that all that I was planning on using? Uh, <clears throat> maybe. Uh, oh. oh, you weren't blockading them. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. All right. All right. Pull the troops back. Oh, nice. You got a, you got a Venator, though. Pull the troops Intel back. We got a retreat. No, 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 no. Goodbye. <laughs> we are, we are out of here. Retreat in progress. Take care, homies. <laughs> oh lord, look at that. All right. So clearly, we need to fight that battle again. No problem. Construction complete. Absolutely, no issue. We'll have Plo Koon deal with it. <laughs> Awaiting your orders. With his new fleet. Now, your orders, General. Tactical battle. Once you get your new fleet again, again with this. You know, I think as a way to stop this, we should probably just send our troops Hello. over. <laughs> to serve you, General. We've secured a bill pad. How can I be of assistance? Uh, I'll tell you what. Our position is secure. Scanners are picking up droids everywhere. Keep it tight and keep the soft shell safe. You've said that a million Go times, Holmes. What if we use the Mon Cala fleet? You can tell that I'm kind of bouncing off on thoughts. I've got a lot of things going on in this Noggin of mine, but if we were to use the Mon Cala fleet as well, while we're building up the fleet to kind of take on um, whatever that planet was, I'm blanking on it, but if we use the Mon Cala fleet, we might be able to get some things done. So let me, let me get some sort of scouts here. Also some Corvettes. By. What if we just bite? What if we, what if we peck at Mintuin? What if we just poke it? What if we, what if we just do something? Something small, nothing radical, but just something. Okay? So I've got some Z95s. I love these ships in the Clone Wars. I don't think they're as rad in this mod, but they were like interceptors back in the Clone Wars, 3D Clone Wars series, and they were Intel super fast, they were super cool looking, and I, I much, I much prefer these, this design to the one in uh, Legends, in the Expanded Universe. Canceled. Stand by. So let's Hold poke them down. real quick, you know? Give them a little poke, and then boom, okay. Maybe not, okay, here we go. Put Kit Fisto. What do you? What do you? I read you, General. Do you pilot, you have a ship. Oh, you have a ship. You've got a little your own fighter. Oh, I see, little. Let your guard down. Don't worry, I'm not your your original starfighter. Okay, let's bring in our vendors here. Oh lord, <laughs> that was a bad idea. This was this was a bad idea. But hey, look at the look at the Z95s. Look at them do their thing. I think they're dying. All right, let's bring them on Cala fleet. See, this is a pretty cute and quirky fleet here. We've got some Mon Cala cruisers. Speedy? 
and maneuverable. Makeshift warship supporting sporting superb bank of lasers, percussion missiles, highly competent, and escort role. That's what I like to hear. And what are these? Psych fighters. Light interceptor, lightest of all starfighters design starfighter designs. Produced by its Mandalorian manufacturer. Okay, named after a lizard. Huh. <laughs> right. Uh Let's see what we can do here with these psych fighters. I noticed you popped your shield. Is it, uh, are you dying out there? Are you doing okay? You seem to be doing pretty rad. Look at that. Now, I wonder how well they fare against... They're not, they're not fair. They are not. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. All right, bombers. We're going to need you to... Kit Fisto. Kit Fisto, Kit Fisto. <laughs> Oh my god, he almost died! What happened to you? This makes you go faster, right? Movement speed and damage. Yeah, what did you just do? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh my <laughs> Okay, so clearly I did not prepare for the effectiveness of the Separatist fleet. And this this Munificent right here does have quite the firepower. Gosh, I wish this weren't below my my line so I can kind of look at it. But look at that. Oh, they have hypervelocity cannon. Okay. <laughs> We're dead. And there goes a the vanity. Overload, friend. Oh, man. Are we actually going to lose? They do have strong resistance. Fisto, uh, no. I think you might actually have to run. So, that's... That's a, a loss for us. Oh my gosh. The first Mon Cala fleet? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I didn't expect it to be that devastating. Oh, nice. Using your, your beam cannon. Nice, nice. Your final hurrah. Please don't die. Please don't die. Don't die on me. <laughs> Alright, focus fire. Focus fire. Oh, it's going after the other Venator, isn't it? No! <laughs> oh my goodness gracious! Oh, and the Arc 170s are getting chewed up as well! Oh, my poor ships! No! <laughs> yeah, so maybe I shouldn't be that, uh, that ballsy, huh? Look, I'm learning. <laughs> All I'm saying is, I am learning. <laughs> That's my defense. We've got a fuzzball of fighters all around this Corvette class. We've got Corvettes coming in, but... I don't know if that too much. Dang, this thing's health. What's going on here? What goes it out of there? Yeah. Okay, I don't know how that guy went down like that. What's going on with this? But oh my gosh, yeah, we we lost big time. Oh, it's a level five. That's why, you know, they got a they got a big fleet. Um, yeah, that's a tragedy. Yeah, it's your thing with the lasers, and you're probably gonna die. And they go, ooh! Wow, and that was was one heck of a separatist fleet engagement. Calgary We're making a jump. This poor guy, all oh, these poor guys, they don't have hyper, they don't have hyperspace capabilities, so it's just Fisto out here. Uh, just you, actually. Oh. That was our first loss. Well, I mean, first loss in a while. And that was a really bad loss, too. Oh my gosh. Wow. I... I'm shocked at how that happened. I'll bring, I'll reorder the Mon Cala fleet, but wow! <laughs> Cruiser ready, sir. I guess expect the unexpected, but geez Louise, they got us. They got us good, but don't worry, we'll bounce back from them, my friends. We will, we will bounce back from that easily. Let me get some Corvettes, and we're moving into Mechus. Light Corvette standing by. Oh. Mon Cala are ready. Indeed. Go to Mechus. Nice. So, 
We might have just taken a big L, but we're about to give one too. Or maybe a better way to say that would be we're about to give Intel one. Says there could be as much God, as a full battalion of droids down there. Yeah, that sounds nerdy. Tough job to dig them all out. <laughs> we'll get there, sir. You know, since the Bad Batch is over, I, I don't really care for too much Star Wars. It's actually kind of strange. I know that's kind of heresy, but I've always been more of an animation guy. I was raised on the Clone Wars. And by raised, you know, I, 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 that was my Changing favorite course. Star Wars. And um, that's kind of been my whole experience with the franchise. And now, Indeed. The Mandalorian, I really like the we first season, but... Shoulder. After watching it with my friends and in, in university and whatnot, we, we haven't just gone around to hanging out again. We're still in college together, but it's our senior year, and that was freshman year. Like, it's been a little while. Because of that, you know, if I'm not watching it with the homies, I don't feel too inclined to... That's a level five. We gotta run. <laughs> This is not a big enough fleet. I don't, I don't feel inclined to be watching anything uh, kind of live action related. Because if it's if it's live action, it's just kind of okay for us, you know. I don't know, maybe maybe you guys think differently. Or, I mean, that's fine. <laughs> I'm just kind of I'm maybe I think differently is what I should say, because I guess I'm kinda of quirky like that. But yeah. Live action stuff's never been really too much of my thing unless it's the original Star Wars. We're retreating. <clears throat> we can't take out a level 5 space station. Please don't. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Losses after losses after losses. We're mounting up quite a few. Uh, I don't think they have a hypervelocity cannon. I didn't check. But wow. Crews are ready, sir. That's pretty embarrassing. <laughs> Here's the plan. We're gonna expose Corellia. And then what we're gonna do... Corellia? Mandalore again? Again? Alright, um... Well, while you're doing that, we're gonna have Anakin combine forces with Plo Koon. This happened once in the show. But it was more so with a typical kind of fighter battle. It was with the Malevolence. Oops. We're going to be a little quirky here. Use a heavy siege fleet with a whole lot of Venators. And let's see if we can break this. You know, they're going to be doing the same thing as us because they're financially okay. And they're going to try to order up some bigger fleets, reinforcement fleets, using the space station. Let's see what I can do here. The day won't come when the droid army can outfight us without a 10 to 1 advantage. Copy that. Okay. Changing course. Course plotted. Corvette Listen, swinging droids. into position. Oh, oh lord, I did not mean to... <laughs> Copy that. Ambition. All right. We're bringing in the Resolute. We're bringing in you, Lauren. We'll get there, sir. We'll you out of here. Let's see if we can bait the... Uh... I'm sorry. Let's see if we can bait the enemy into fighting Yularen with just a small support fleet. Wow, that beam cannon. Nice. I knew they had a hypervelocity cannon. Oh my goodness. Okay. We are running again. We are running again. Just loss after loss after loss on this campaign or on this in this episode you know i'm jeez louise okay not only did we just lose a corvette but we also Tactical <laughs> battle imminent. almost lost you lauren yeah, same fleet composition and everything three lucre hogs huh you really want to fight us over mandalore with the same exact fleet comp three lucre hogs and a carrier <laughs> Well, thank goodness I've got this available. upgrade going because we just have reinforcements and reinforcements and reinforcements. Is it overpowered? Eh, mildly. <laughs> this upgrade, but I'll tell you what, it's pretty rad. It's pretty rad. Kind of saving our butts with a lot of this, a lot of the fighting here. Okay, that's the extent of what we have here. So this is our fleet comp. They're sending in their fighters. We're going to do the same. 
We're sending in our bombers. Take out the hangers of that Luger Hawk. The bottom. All fighters on hunt. We're going to start shelling the enemy. Got an artillery piece here. Bit of, bit of a support fleet. Again, I can't emphasize this enough. This is a glorious looking fleet. I mean, look at this. And what's really cool is you can get if you can get the uh, the fighter battle near these small corvettes, you can really get a very cool perspective. I mean, look at that. Look at that. Look at them. All right, guys. Get the hangar. To the next one. Oh lord. <laughs> Look at that fleet. My gosh. You know we might have been taking a few L's in this battle, but or in this this episode, but you can't you can't deny it. that is pretty awesome. You can see the vulture droids in the background. Ooh. Ooh, one viewing getting trailed. And this is going much better than the last battle, mainly because of the reinforcement fleet. Admittedly. Mainly because of that. Let me send this guy over. Meanwhile, you got the hangar on that one, you've got the hangar on Wow, you've incapacitated both. Well, since this one's exposed, let's let's go for it. I'm gonna have you guys lock into uh, flight mode, actually. We're gonna see if you can pull some sort of alpha strike here. You're gonna be under a lot of fire, so use those rear turrets if you can, or not. It's pretty much an alpha strike. They're they're gonna do. They're going to send their bombs away, but that's kind of good. That's all they're going to be able to do. Because as soon as they get into that kind of fuzzball, they're dead. Nice, 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 nice. All right, off 170s. So with these Lucre Hawks, their main uh, kind of appeal is their hangar space. They're just massive carriers. They do have some guns, like quad turbo lasers right here. Um, and it's it's... Pretty, they're pretty good combat wise, but their main thing is that they just send unlimited waves of fighters. So you want to try to take out the hangars ASAP, and then they're just kind of sitting back. So they do have a lot of uh, health though. Compared to this, this is kind of combat half and then hangar half, you know? They carry a few fighters and then they're probably cheap. Yeah, they're cheaper than the Luke Hawks. Literally in the description, they're cheaper than the Luke Hawks. And you can carry a lot of them. They might be even better than the Hawks, because the Looper Hawks can be kind of slow, be kind of bulky. Maybe they're a good center of the fleet, whereas this is kind of supportive. So, these are different little carriers. I think Awakening of the Rebellion actually has a great way to define carriers. It's got endurance carriers, and then it has, like, battle carriers. So the battle carriers kind of uh, send out all of the fighters, versus endurance carriers, they, uh, they do it in waves. I might have actually had that in reverse, but either way. I haven't played that mod in a, in a little bit. I'm stuck with this one. Gotta finish this campaign. Oh my gosh. And this vultures got trailed. <laughs> they were followed by my my, my ships. That was, that was cruel. Alright. So we almost lost you, Lauren. I don't think that's a good that's a good thing. So here's the plan. I'm going to take that Venator, or that, that experimental fleet. I need somebody to command it, though. I want it to be Sheev, but I don't. Aren't you a freak? Like, didn't you, didn't you, like, kill, nearly kill Ahsoka? Why don't you lead it? <laughs> Why don't you have the honors of leading that fleet? You know what? Yeah. Why don't we have you do that? Unit in production. Da, 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 da. I just want to make sure once we, if we get attacked on Duro, that it's well defended. 
versus Coruscant. Coruscant's kind of going to be a sitting duck with a lot of bait. We've got Palpatine there, we shall arrive uh, and just a few Venators. And of course, uh, you know, that. Construction complete. <clears throat> but we've got clones, we can soldiers. have Fordo there. I want Coruscant to be a, a good battle. So I'm going to let them do their thing. I'm going to let them kind of bottom right. It's yours for now. Take on Coruscant. Leave Rothana alone. Will you guys? I see you over there. Oh my god, I should probably just let them have it. This is getting ridiculous. Training. I only want the best with my unit. Alright, did, did she come over yet? No. Okay. Do you think do construction you think so? complete? Sorry, sorry. Training. Maybe I'm a little recruitment. Cancel. Shield generator. Overzealous. Constructing. Building started. Unit canceled. Uh, what's the difference? Long range scanner, ready. gravity well. Available. Yeah, we want a gravity well. Light Corvette standing by. Wouldn't it be ironic if I were to get some CR 90s or CR 70s Tactical and put it in this fleet? Imminent. I think that'd be pretty funny. Let's let's order up a few and then let me finish up this Rothana battle. <laughs> I think maybe after a few more of these kinds of battles, I might just kind of send our troops into the fray, because I don't want you guys to constantly see me defend this planet. It's, it's just getting ridiculous. At least I got the ATRTs kind of moving in. But man, these lats are... They're good, but they, they're probably overpowered. <laughs> So they're landing the troops and everything, but they can't do anything about these gunships. They really cannot. I gotta kind of moderate this. You know, I, I need to make sure that I kind of hold fast. Now, although I did say that I, I'm not a big fan of the Mandalorian, <clears throat> I'm not like, you know, I don't dislike it. It's just not something that I personally would watch too much of. I did hear that there were a couple cameos, which I'm not going to spoil anything, but there were a couple cameos, like celebrity cameos in the show that were kind of kind of took people out of Star Wars. I mean, if you're watching this, tell me about it. Tell me your experience with it, because, I don't know, maybe it's inappropriate for them to have those types of cameos, or maybe it's appropriate. Maybe it's cool. Maybe it's, like, some sort of kind of new age thing. I don't know. Which is something I'm, I'm not particularly privy to. Now, we're, we're, remember, we're sending in the experimental fleet, of which we are also going to... I'll, I'll put the CR-70s there. Of which we're also going to be facing off against a... Hypervelocity cannon. At your command. N1 standing by. Construction complete. So N1 ready. At your command. We will see. So ten and nine. Let's let's get fifteen up on Duro so they don't even think command. about it. <clears throat> right? Okay. Now this this is gonna be That's a pretty funny fleet, I'm not gonna lie. Having a rebel, mixed rebel, mixed Tactical imperial star destroyer imminent. fleet. Yeah, let's do that. Let's 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 do that. I think that'd be fun. At your command. <laughs> Choose your Cute and quirky. What do you command? You've That's got your own starfighter. Yeah. Okay. One You'll help out. You'll be good. At a time. Armed and ready. Head full. You do your thing, and uh, we'll very much appreciate it. Underway. No. Moving into position. As soon as we Moving get in out. range, as soon as we see them, we immediately Yeah. Moving All into right. position. Moving out. Give me a line of sight here. Right away. Oh, you missed all of them. Ooh. Ooh. Orders, sir. Okay. Order confirmed. Coming around. Just Calculating go, go, go. We shall arrive shortly. Super duper super heavy fleet. Trajectory plotted. And ballsy trajectory. too. We shall arrive shortly. So Just bring in everybody. Everybody. Ready for action. Oh my gosh. Okay, I did lose a CR70. Oh, I lost that Corellian Corvette. Okay, move. Star Start moving. Everyone move up. We gotta get going. Yes, come on, They're gonna send in that hypervelocity cannon, and we're gonna have problems. I want you to start firing on that massive space station. You are going to be taking the brunt of the fire here. I have 
Make sure you aim for it. Here we go, okay. Okay, so apparently you're going to be taking the brunt of the fire. Well, not really. Not really. You serve the dark side, more like. That's, that's kind of nerdy, but yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw, I saw you in the show. Don't lie to me. <laughs> I've seen a thing or two. I know what's going on behind the scenes. Freak. <laughs> yeah, so if you haven't seen the show, spoiler alert, but she did betray the Jedi. And so, she's not actually that, uh, that Jedi-like as it would appear, not very monk-like. She had performed a bombing in the uh, Jedi Temple. Yeah, spoiler, 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 it's been ten years, but spoiler, spoiler, spoiler. And it was a beautiful set of episodes. Some people have been kind of nitpicking it as of recent, but in my experience, you know, it was some of the best Clone Wars content that I had seen, especially at the time, you know, and Barrow was top tier, it will always be for me, probably, besides Siege of Mandalore. But that was definitely, like, solid. It was absolutely fantastic. And, like I said, you know, Clone Wars is my, is my childhood, and these kinds of Clone Wars mods really did kind of shape my experience with Star Wars. I loved kind of imagining myself as a clone and just kind of thinking about like these really cool battles and of course i didn't have a, a, a nice computer to play this on so it'd be running at like three frames my dream was always to be some sort of like um gaming youtuber when i was especially young you know, I was, that was a big thing um around like 2012 2013 the whole gaming scene was starting to explode and people were talking about like building computers it was not like as popular as now it wasn't popular at all really and me as an 11 and 12 year old, I I was I was dreaming about it, you know. And just recently in college, my parents recommended that I get to a gaming PC, so I got this gaming laptop to kind of help with the stress, you know, because I'm in uh, I'm in grad school. Wow, the battle ended, by the way, beautiful. But yeah, I'm in grad school, um, and I've been doing this for a little while, and the stress had been kind of building up, so. We had purchased this computer. And since then, I haven't really played games. <laughs> I'm going to be honest. I played like one game the entire last year that I bought this. So I thought, you know, maybe starting this kind of small YouTube channel would make me, incentivize me. It would, it would incentivize me to continue playing games because I have people who are relying on me and counting on me to, you know, be entertained. So I, I hope you're, you're enjoying this little campaign. I know I'm kind of all over the place sometimes. It's just kind of how I am. Um, especially at this point in my life where I have to keep moving. So, apologies. But <laughs> as I'm saying that I am multitasking because I think it's now time to, bro, it's going to be time to, to take out Mechus using Kiari Mundi. But yeah, that's kind of a little backstory of why I even play games in the first place. I, I've never been that big of a gamer, actually. I, I, I've lived vicariously through other video game players because I could never afford... The, uh, for the gaming setup, so I just kind of watch other people do it, and it was fun for me. You know, I just kind of enjoyed other people playing games, and I just sit around for the company. And so now that I'm doing it, it's a, it's a new experience. And so we're we're popping off right now. We're we're doing the same thing per usual. It looks like something red out here. It's, it's kind of looking a little tempered for me, you know. Let's see, bringing in the lats. Look at this. Look at this. What a mess. What's going on in here? All oh, these homies are getting lit up. We even have the. <laughs> I even brought this guy. What if we just bring everyone here? Just bring everyone. Look, finally, we've got the Jedi. Shock T's coming. It's the whole gang. <laughs> the whole gang is here. Everyone's here to party. It's a raid. Should be ending soon. I think it should be ending momentarily, right? Or not. They're going to keep going. Okay. We've got the locals coming in to join the festivities. <laughs> and now the droids are running. All right. As soon as they saw the, the local army. <laughs> like, oh, no. We can't, we can't do that here. <laughs> Uh, too scary. <laughs> oh, but they're pretty rad. Uh, excuse me. Oh, they stopped the retreat. Okay. 
Uh, what a mess. I don't think we took any casualties in that battle. Look at this. So overpowered. Alright. Let's move. Mechus? I do believe we're going to have some fierce resistance. I was wrong. <laughs> My guesses seem to always be incorrect, but if there are we'll follow you turrets, um, Okay. Choose your reinforcements. That would be quite problematic if there are. Be observant. We're in enemy territory. It's gonna be yes, a tough indeed. job to dig them all out. Right away, General. All right. We'll start off right with away, a couple platoons so and one sir. big boy. And we'll see what we can do here. Clones keep the scrap merchants busy. The artillery. Oh, Kiati Mundi. Let's see. Look at that. He's got a medic. He's got his big. Big ponytail. And then we got Bakara, who they didn't make me commander for nothing. Very cool clone. I believe he was known for being pretty T pose. To be pretty aggressive. I'm proud to serve you. I, I believe he was kind of known for being a pretty aggressive looking or pretty Enemy aggressive contact. clone in general. So since that's the case, this is gonna be a fun time. Oh, they got artillery. Here's the problem. Dealing with these is a real pain Our position in the back is ready for battle, sir. But oh, look at this massive tanker. Look at this thing. It's like a hovercraft. You'd think it'd like walk on those treads or something. It's kind of weird. But it's like an ATAT, ATTE, but a little less versatile, sacrificing its versatility for Wrong probably a little sir. more speed, maybe. We do our job. Your so we're gonna kind of set up our artillery, our own artillery, to help us out because this is gonna be this is gonna be a pretty okay, tough fight. All right, start moving up. Give eyes for the artillery. This battle isn't over until we've scrapped the last clanker. Never surrender. Understood, General. Since this map is big, we're gonna split them up into two teams. What's our field commander do? 25% out here, sight range. That's what I like to hear. Oh, there's fire, there's fire. Come on, take out those turbo lasers. Ooh, who got destroyed? Oh, did I lose artillery? Yes, I did. Yeah, they must have been in range. Yeah, he was in range. I am. Ooh, so sorry. Choose your reinforcements. Alright, that's okay. They will not defeat us. Yes, All right, master. so do you get anybody? Just you, but that's okay, I got you a commander. I have faith in our victory. Me too, I homie. The force. Let's go. I think you General, do you heal? Oh, you might heal. Okay, let's see. Padawan, blah 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 blah, Luminara. Yep, heal yourself and units around her. Okay, and they're running away from you. They're scared of you. They know your history. Since you are our main assault group, I want you to first move and take out that command post. After that, we're going to use you to... Okay. We're going to use you to charge the enemy. So Kiati Mundi is going to be the homie who's going to move in and take out the enemy base. We're going to have uh, Varus Afi, on the other hand, kind of help us out with... Out. Landing troops. The extra troops. Is this is a weird battle. <laughs> All right. Looks like you got it. This is very cool. Also capable of troop transport. Yeah, military capable of traversing unstable terrain, although heavily armed. Also we do capable our of troop transport. Well. That's Copy that, that's a pretty rad little tanker there. Is a Come on, troops! General. Come on! Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh. So these troops are the Galactic Marines. They're supposed to be super versatile with their yes, combat capabilities, but I'm going to be honest, it doesn't look oh, it's gonna be a uh, I don't know if it's but... <laughs> My blade is at your service. Oh, oh my gosh, I squeaked there. Was that stay, one? Bro, stay. <laughs> to engage the enemy. Better get over there, too. Heal him. Heal him up. Heal him up. This club doesn't lose. Yes, Alright, let's get the assault group. Yes, 
Get more troops, get more troops, get, more troops. get the land troops. Let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. We're ready for battle, sir. Move in. Watch the rear. All right, everybody. You doing all right back there? Uh, no. You lost your commander. Why? You must have ran into turrets. Oh, no. I'm so sorry. That's just you and three homies. Well, let's wrap up the fittest it looks like. These three seem to be pretty competent either way. All right. Okay, everybody. Assault group, get going. You're the Galactic Marines. You're kind of known for charging in, right? Let's see to it. Let's see this, this military charge. I'm going to bring one artillery piece with them as they kind of follow along. I'm going to have to guard this one. So kind of join in on the battle here. Meanwhile, Luminara, get that My last point with your, your, your three troops. <laughs> oh, so sad. Look, it's just three. Oh, we got dumb, dumb, and dumber out here. <laughs> if you wish. Oh, Lord. Oh, well, would you look at that? We found some droids. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, guard the troops. Yeah, it looks like they're about to shoot her, though. <laughs> Looks like they're missing and aiming for her. That's, that's some Order 66 right there. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Got a problem here. Don't worry. I'm sending in a bombing run. The most over-the-top bombing run. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why, are, why is the infantry going one way? And you guys going the other? What's going on here? The wild ones gonna do their thing. Ah, yikes. Right. You guys are going just the wrong way. What are you doing back there? No, you have to keep moving. That's I advise. I will not hesitate. I agree. We we do need patience here. I'm I'm quite an impatient person. Taking a lot of damage. We lost a build pad. Our position is secure. We do our job. All right, man. Hold this we position. A build pad. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kill all of you and pull a pull a General Corral. We cannot uh, let our guard down. You can't negotiate with your way on it, sir. This yes. battle isn't over until we've scrapped the last clanker. Move around there. Never surrender. Destroyed. What? 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 One shot. One kill. We've lost a build pad. What the heck? Right there. Oh my God. These maps with this map in particular, I know is reused not a few times. I hate these maps. <laughs> I do not like these maps because I'm always getting stuck. They will not defeat us. They might defeat you actually. All right, come on, guys. Let's win this. The Sith have returned. Huge map. I will not hesitate. You might. The time has All right, everyone, group up. We've lost a build. We've secured a build. All right, everybody, group up with the medic. Combat is a clone's natural. The homie heal you. Right away, sir. Sir, yes, sir. Move out. The army will be. Oh, there's gonna be a firefight. I advise patience. Artillery Weapon there. Good. Get some artillery here. Understood, sir. Stay frosty. Could use the support. Oh, Unit well, that one's destroyed. gone. Been, yeah, it was flanked by droids. Prepare to engage the enemy. Bombardment of the monster. You know what I want you to do? I want you to guard that. Meanwhile, 
our objective is to take out that shield generator. We take out the shield generator, we can use the bombardment to our advantage. Got that, troops? Man, we lost a lot of our fighting force. My gosh. And Bakara, Bakara is... I don't know why the commanders in this mod are always so much slower than everyone else. But they, they... It's just kind of weird. <laughs> Take out that shield, guys. Let's see what you can do. Yeah, I do too, but... Even still. Oh, is that? Yes, master. Is that the shield generator's? What you call it? The, the power generator for the guns? Oh my gosh, I'm blind. That would have been brilliant to have on us. Might be one right here. Yeah, there is. Oh, it's a double. All right, troops, you're getting assaulted from both. Go, go, go. Take that one down and keep going for this one. Meanwhile, I want you guys to kind of move. You got to move quick. Another one here. What are these? Fuel container. Oh my gosh. Watch the rear. Let's go. Oh my gosh, this is stupid. <laughs> Was bad. Oh no, your last troop. Is that who is that? It's fighting you. It's a sentinel droid. Uh, behind you, buddy. Oh, I'm getting a call. Oh, just for that. So it shall be. Oh Lord, alright. Send the bombers in. I can't believe that just happened. Starting my bombing run. Yeah. The force also serves Can you. So it shall be. Take that down. Yeah, okay. Come on, send the bombers in, see what they can do. I don't know if they can do much, but they'll help out. They'll probably be. Oh. <laughs> they will not defeat us. Yeah, right. Perfect. Okay. Now that we got the power generator off, we should be able to take on. <laughs> the enemy a bit better. Golly, that artillery is just the worst. We cannot let our guard down. What is that? What is this? Is this another thing that'll blow up? Oh, it's a hypervelocity gun. Oh, hey. <laughs> Alright. I can do that. Take this stupid thing out. Killed us last time. Oh my gosh, the droids that poured out of it. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Bring the medic. Bring the medic. What are we waiting for? Copy that. I advise patience. I remain vigilant. My gosh. All right, get over there. We're proud to serve you, General. Yes, it's too bad we lost our line of sight. We cannot let our guard down. What is that? Is that another Sentinel droid? Brother Bear. I will not hesitate. Pause the game. What the heck is this? Oh my God, they're fast. You doing all right back there? Oh. I'm oh, sorry. You're chasing him, right? Sprint. The boss gives a Jedi his power. Nice, nice, nice. He's healing himself, not nice. But he's running into our other troops. This should be good. Our position is secure. Come on, man. Shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Nice. Alright. Let's get over there. 
point. Now we just have to kind of, now we have to figure out where the enemy is. Oh my goodness gracious, with this limited amount of troops, you gotta be kidding me. Yeah, you do your thing. Uh, is the medic here by any chance to heal up a car? Guys are gonna be kind of. I have to take cover. Use his backline. Oh! Oh my goodness! One shot, one kill. My blade is at your service. The Sith have returned. Lost Bakara. Artillery's gonna do its thing. Are you getting chased? You're getting chased. Is there more? Oh no, get him. Oh, the medic! Finally lost the medic. Goodness, this is ridiculous. The amount of just running around to get these last troops. Yes, master. Yes, master. General. Always leave more droids than clients on the battlefield. Yes, general. They will not defeat us. Wait. Hold on a second. Are you kidding me? <laughs> is that what I've been missing? Besides, you know, the, the extra troops as well. But like, is this what I've been missing? I do damage to this guy. We can take these rust buckets. Oh my goodness gracious. Let's move on. Move out, man. Oh, 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 don't do that. Don't fight that. No, 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 no. Oh! Bombing run. Copy. Got any eyes? Well, I hope he did something. So here's the plan. I think because of how ridiculously long this is taking. I'm gonna retreat, I'm gonna pull back, and I'm just gonna kinda sweep it with some lats. That'll save us some time and save us a headache. Just gonna pull everybody back. Come on, everyone. We are leaving. No, 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 you gotta go back. Come on, mad dash, come on. I serve the force. Look, the lone oh, surviving the clone, fight. my gosh. The Sith have returned. The time has come. Alright, everyone, pull back. Pull back. No, 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 no. We're not losing this battle. We oh my gosh, we lost so many troops. But we are not losing this battle. We we're only pulling back so I can get some more gunships. In production. These gunships would have been so helpful in this battle. And I presume I, I was thinking I'd Invasion use them too. But give me gunships. And we're gonna finish this. Weapons check. Choose your reinforcements. Reinforcements Stay oh. oh, that's just great. <laughs> cancelled. Because the gunships can't capture points, I'm stuck with two. I still have the turrets, huh? Towards the rear. Never give up. So okay, where are the here droids we here? We'll follow you anywhere, sir. Clones keep the scrap merchants busy. Hmm. I'm proud to serve you, General. Understood, General. Gosh, this must have been what yes, Vietnam was like, just kind of going through blind. 
Because all I'm doing here is just roaming. Trying to find where the enemy is. I can't even find them. We do our job well. You say that, but I see no droids. There we go. Finally, some contact. Wait, I thought there was. Isn't there a droid here? Yeah, there is. There. Now, where else? God, this is ridiculous. Alright, let's try it. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh! How do I even lose a fleet commander? How many L's have we company. taken? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. How is this happening? This has been the most L worthy. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> right away, General. Let's blow something up. Just, just bring troops over. Just kind of throw everyone there. I want this to be done. <laughs> I don't want to deal with that. Oh, goodness, I really hate that. But what do you want from Renvar now? Is it the same? Oh, whoa, HMP gunships. Oh, no. Oh, oh, balls. That's actually, that is a new one. All right, you know what? I'll fight this one. I'm not going to retreat. I'm not going to do any of that. We're actually going to fight this. I want to I wanna see what goes on. We might lose, but I want to see what happens. Roger that, sir. I want you all to go here, maybe get some anti-air, I don't know. But, same procedure, I want all the fast guys on me. So everyone, everyone move. I don't, I don't know if they had artillery or not, but they certainly have air. So that's a new one, that's super exciting. Yeah, definitely mounting losses here, my gosh. Oh, ooh! Is that some, like, mild artillery? Okay. Hold that back line. Alright, troops. Ooh! We're gonna need, we're gonna need something here. Oh, oh lord. Oh no, it's the air. It's the air! Let's see if you can just avoid it for now, because you can't do anything. Oh my gosh, they're really taking you out of the legs. Kind of just push for, for what they got right now. That's a great composition, though. Anyways, we can't, we can't even do anything. We can only bottleneck them at this point, but anti-air is it's just hard to come by in this mod. See if you do ATRTs. Ooh, they're shooting rockets at you all. Oh my gosh. Watch it. Nice, nice. Yeah, we are. We're not doing so hot here. Wow, but that air is fantastic on their side, too. So look, see, I wasn't the only one taking advantage of the overpower. <laughs> it was overpowered. And it still is. Nice. Right dead center. It still sucked, though. Just, yeah, just kind of use your, your Z6 Gatling guns. Nice, you actually got a kill. Imagine being that clone who took out a tank with his minigun. Oh, you feel so rad. Our base Thanking is under attack. Yes, General. All right, all right. Copy that. Right away, I don't know what you could do there. Ooh, dead center in the middle of them. Okay, yeah, that's that is kind of it. That's pretty sacrificial. Oh my goodness! Wow! Wow! That's insane how powerful that thing is. The HMP is good. This is the first ground battle I think we've ever lost. And all we have is this one anti-air, so we're just gonna we're just gonna sit back and pray. Ooh. <laughs> oh no. Let's see what they do. I wanna I wanna see this 
anti-air kind of do its thing. Is it good? Does it work? Does it work? <laughs> do you work? Um, no. <laughs> the answer is no, it does not. Um, okay. <laughs> Got some original phase one clones. Glad to see these guys back in action, but uh, it's a little tragic that this is kind of how they're, this is how it's going. <laughs> oh my god, there goes Renvar. <laughs> Oh my goodness, but we're not done yet. No, we're not done. This episode is not over yet because we're sending in everyone just to auto resolve. <laughs> Except the 501st. I don't know why I brought them over. My bad. I'm sending everyone in just to freaking auto resolve. <laughs> I don't want to deal with it. I really don't want to deal with it. I sent the wrong units there. Okay. I the now I want to deal with. Invasion retaking this planet. Just wow. Why? System control achieved. Beginning construction. construction. Never again. Building I am started. never fighting over this planet again. Absolutely not. Get me away from that. I do not like this map. <laughs> Cause some maps are being repeated in this mod because you know, I mean they're not paid to mod, they're just kinda doing their thing and they're great to make. I mean, they made them well. It's just that God, it's just terrible. <laughs> this is really painful to fight because I don't want to have to sit around and just kind of, because it's such a big map, I don't want to have to sit around and just kind of do my thing. Um, looking for them, so. Complete. That's that. Tactical battle <sighs> okay, one more battle. And then we're leaving. <laughs> one more of these, okay? Ready? Everyone just move. Everyone kind of go. General. Or makes it their first congrats. Heads up. Droids inbound. Oh man, these poor droids. This really is kind of a money sink. They're, they're really spending a lot of money to get these droids and they're not getting much out of it. We are victorious. <laughs> what a chaotic what a chaotic episode my gosh we didn't really even get very far yeah we took out mechas but we lost renvar and i lost so many troops on mechas so i guess started. building under construction yeah this was kind of an l i'm not gonna say that's a bad thing you gotta take some losses but it certainly is a little bit of a chaotic episode and with that said thank you very much for watching i hope we have a more positive one but hey at least i got this one done far quicker than the last so until next time peace